What's going on everybody? I'm Jeff Robe and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey how you doing? Today I got this uh, about medium sized box. I think we got two pairs in it. We're going to bust it open, check them out, see what it's working with, see who they're from. That way you guys can be on your way to building your collection just like I build mine for a fraction of the price that all of these companies are trying to sell you this stuff for because it's a bit outrageous and you know most people are struggling to pay bills let alone buy a $250 pair of sneakers so I want to help you out I want you to save some money and I want you to feel good look good the way that you want to look make sure you're following me in my discord um, there you can shoot me messages you can post pictures of what you want and I can get links for you um, or I can put you on to sellers that will likely have the products that you're after uh, yeah it's about as easy as that I pretty much sift through all of the bad stuff um, in the course of time that I've been doing this I've got to help lots of people, meet lots of people, and it's fun, man. It's fun. Plus, it's fun to look good. We're just in the day and age where everyone gets to see their favorite celebrities and stuff on YouTube or TikTok, on live, pretty much daily. They see what they're wearing, they want to wear it too, you know? All right, let's get this thing open. I think I see a Jordan box off the rip. Right. Nicely packaged in there. As you can see. Let's see. These things are like airtight in there. So let's try to gracefully pull them out maybe. Man, these things are in there. Whoo! Man, I just went to war with that. All right. So before we get into these, let's uh. Whoo! Goodness gracious, that was tough. Those were sucked in there. These are looking absolutely beautiful, though. We got the Jordan 4 white Oreo. Absolutely great looking shoe. I actually played golf in these for a whole season. Uh, oh, really, really nice shoe. It has that nice crispy white leather. And this one's actually pretty easy to keep clean. Just use that Clorox wipe wiper down. Everything's gonna be a-okay. Jordan logo on the back. And that is for both of them. Gray around the midsole, clear bubble, which is my favorite. I like it when they just leave the bubble alone. Sometimes they'll throw some random cover colors in the bubble. It's like, what are you doing? This thing just feels really, really good. Both of these are going to be from Will as well. He is in the Discord, so if you want to get in contact with him, you can do so. Perfect tongue on here. Nice stitching. It smells good, too. Yeah. This is a really good shoe. Really, really good shoe. Yeah. Beautiful. Can't go wrong with the Jordan 4. One of my favorite silhouettes up there with the 1s and the 3s and the 11s. Yeah, very nice. Let's check out this one that was giving us such a hard time. Size 13, Jordan 14. And if you're in the Discord, you probably saw these. Yeah. Man, I really hope this is a size 13 and not an 11. Yeah, it is. Making sure it wasn't the wrong size. There's a sticker on here that says 11, so it had me wondering. Jordan 14. Don't do too many of these. This one's got an all uh, kind of velvet suede going on black with those white accents pretty sick looking shoe especially in the winter time bringing out those textures got that Jordan shield right there at the top all black on the bottom apart from that one little 
dot that has XIV14 on it. Kind of this uh, ridged sole. And then, of course, got a little vent here. A little metal grate screen. That's pretty cool. Yeah, look at those textures on there. You can almost vacuum this thing. <laughs> or lint roll it. You need a lint roll it before you wear it. I don't know how hard these will be to keep clean. Um, just from being in the box, they kind of are getting dusty. But, I mean, I'm wiping it off and it's coming right off. So that's that at least. Yeah, almost feels like a towel. It's a pretty cool shoe. I just haven't really, I haven't seen this one. I'm a big fan of the weatherized 12s. But these are definitely not weatherized. I wouldn't wear these if it was raining. The classic 14 back on there with those kind of casino looking roulette wheel numbers. And then the Jordan at the top. Pretty cool. Looks really good from that side. Not a bad looking shoe at all. Jordan 14. Let me know where that sits on your list of Jordans, if it's one of your favorites or if it's one of your least favorites. Like I said, I don't really do too many Jordan 14s. They seem to not make a whole bunch of those, um, but it just kind of is what it is. I, it just notoriously hasn't been too popular of a style. I don't have a lot of people reaching out and asking for Jordan 14s um, unless it's like that specific uh, Ferrari pair. I think it's the red pair. There's a yellow pair that they have as well. Um, I actually don't have any personal Jordan 14s, I don't think, unless I just have like a funky one somewhere. Yeah, I don't think I do. Um, but that doesn't mean that they're not comfortable, and that doesn't mean that if you're not, or, and that doesn't mean that if you're after one that you can't get it, I'd be more than happy to help you find whichever one you're after. Um, but sometimes the sizing can be limited on those, especially some of the not so popular, like it's almost it, like hard to find um, Jordan 7s, 8s, 9s, 10s, like the stuff that, you know, isn't as popular as the 1, 2, 3s, and 4s, 11s. Uh, 12s are even popular. They make a lot of 12s. It kind of boils down to like how... Um, much collabs they have too because it's like once someone collabs with a certain style then like that style will get popular for six to eight months and they'll make more pairs like if the gamma blues or something drops or uh off-white did something with the silhouette then of course that style of sneaker is gonna get more popular but yeah i'm jeff rope thanks for tuning in today hopefully you like these pairs that i showed off today like i said they're from will he is over in the discord make sure you're hanging out over there say what's up be more than happy to send you on your way to save some money and i'll be back next time when i got some more stuff for you